Okay, so last week hot dogs actually happened. But before I tell you how it went, I need to go back a couple of weeks. We had gotten into the festival, but I didn't know if it was the right place to be premiering. But after they convinced me that they would put all their effort into making it a successful launch, I knew we had to make it work. For 10 years, I've been struggling to make films. I've tried to make stuff I believe in, but I'm always let down. Instead, I've decided to document my life and struggle to create. Tror du okej? Gå försiktigt bara. Det är lite läskigt här. Prior to the festival nomination, I was turned down for production funding. It was the same version, which put the project on hold for a couple of months. But I also had a baby. At this time, a friend of mine and a talented editor who's been helping me out with the story offered to come and stay with me for a week to finish the film. As we were planning when he would come, I got the offer from Hot Talks, which forced us to act quickly. So Tom got on a plane from Budapest to Stockholm. Then we lived in my studio for a week to finish the film. Because we didn't really plan for the film to be finished, I asked Hot Dogs for an extension to deliver the DCP master. Being granted that gave us the time we needed, but we needed to move fast. I know a lot of people, they really want that fancy equipment and everything, but to me, I think it's so important to have like versatile and easy to manage equipment. So for me, having like a small steady cam, having small cameras, having a Genie Mini, which can track shots, even if I'm on my own, uh, just remotely controlled on my iPhone, that's, oh, it's such a blessing compared to having the big reds or Alexis, which are fantastic image quality, but you can't use them because you need a whole fucking team to manage them. Uh, and that doesn't work for me, for other, other people, perfect. But for me, no thanks. Then I went to my friends at Cineast to do the final mixing of the audio. All of this, turning the rough cut into a final film, was done in more or less three weeks. Because we didn't have funding, I also had to learn how to make the DCP myself. I can really recommend people looking into Open DCP. It's free, but you need to know what you're doing because you can really mess up the color if you're not aware of the pitfalls. I used it together with DaVinci Resolve, which worked really great. But that process of making it and uploading it, it took about a week. Finally, the film was done, sort of. We still need to go back after the festival to do some minor adjustments. There's no turning back now. There's no turning back now. God gave me talent, so I'm gonna use it. Don't need your advice, better two cents. Bad minds, disguised friends, can't even support a brother with the same black skin. But forget that, this ain't about race, religion, or even gender. Fuck each and every one of you haters. When I die, my music will live forever. I set my goals and I achieve them. The hardest part is believing. Believe me, I'm here for a reason. Give a real nick your ears and just listen. It's fate, I'm destined to be the worst of the new generation. Simply put, I will not lose. I'm heading for the mess. Oh.
Hey, thanks for watching. Let me know what you want to hear more about. Comment below. And don't forget to subscribe. Alright, see you next week.